You know what is the best part of your day now? You just clicked on this video. Hey guys, I hope you're doing great. I'm back as always with another video. Let's be smart enough and positive and take advantage of the time we spend at home because of coronavirus. Fortunately, there's a lot of plenty of tricks in order to stay mentally strong, happy, motivated despite this crisis and become a better version of yourself after the breakdown. If it's your first time here, welcome aboard, I'm Mac and I'm sharing each week some tips about how to be the best version of yourself. If it sounds interesting, let's hop straight into it. The first secret is keep your schedule full. You have to be fully busy during the day. I know when you are free lying down on the couch, catastrophic thoughts start running through the, your mind, which decreases the mood swings. So first thing you can do is Restyle your bookshelves, touch up your pant, renovate your entire living room, terrace, backyard, dining room, rearrange things for a fresh perspective. Day by day you will be surprised how the new org environment will improve your mood. Also turn back on time, dig up old albums, phone contacts to restore the old happy moments and to catch up with your old friends which can bring back the warm feelings you had with them. Also they give us hope that life will go back to the way it was. And also working out. Exercising is not only a mood lifter but a shield against coronavirus. Studies shown that people with a low immunity system are easy to be infected because the body does not function properly. In contrary to people who exercise in a regular way, they can tackle the virus even if they are infected. And keep it safe guys. The second secret is when you are feeling down, try some mood boosters. When you feel down, there are a plenty of activity that you can do at home to reduce the stress and depression. For instance, take a long bath while listening to music. It's a form of therapy because bath restores the balance of our serenity in a rhythm of temperature besides more incredible results. Get plenty of sleep, more rest and recuperation can highly improve your mood because lack of sleep can result in some serious setbacks such as being anxious and energetic. Laugh and a smile is one of the best methods to fight through bad days because laughing is the quickest way to decrease the depression hormones and decrease the happiness hormones through the brain. You can watch a funny film or sitcom, read a funny book, listen to a funny podcast, socialize more with your finest friends. Generally, laughter has to be a part of your journey. And the next secret is maintain social connection. Due to social distancing and lockdown, touches, hugs, cuddles are no longer permitted in order to protect our loved ones. Despite all this prohibition, you have to stay in contactless connection via video call or audio on FaceTime, Skype, Zoom, Google Hangout in order to check on parents, friends, best friends whatever and sit some challenges together online gaming and the best step is discuss to each other about your observation helps you to make these unusual times feel a little less stressful it's a very effective way to tackle the stress and depression in this crisis and keep the flame of love kindness alive despite the distance the fourth tip is be selective in social media Coronavirus and its science facts and statistics are the breaking news nowadays, which can be agitating, anxious, and traumatic. Consequently, use your technology to your advantage and be very selective and wise. Avoid all platforms publishing constantly coronavirus news, avoid 24-7 news channels and feeds unless it's your business. However, you need to schedule some time to check on directive authority information that may impact you directly. And the final tip is taking advantage of the found time. Reconsider your lifestyle now and priorities. It's the shot. Many times you said, I wish I have more time. Here we go now. You remember those times I would learn English or play guitar, but I couldn't find a spare time? You have that chance now. 
Now you have more than enough time to upgrade your skills or start learning a new expertise such as language, new instrument, blogging, vlogging, lockdown or spending more time at home after lockdown doesn't have to be boring. Not if you keep yourself occupied by improving yourself. Clever people always ride on the wave of crisis to develop their abilities. Spending another day on the sofa looking at the TV won't solve any problem and won't put you any further. The lockdown is the opportunity to level up and embrace a new good habits and embrace a new and a best version of yourself. With all that being said, if you could change one thing in your life using these advices, what would it be and what would happen as a result? Tell us in the comments and don't forget to subscribe and turn on the notifications and see you guys.